KDOI 2 News, first at 4. The Mountain Home Country Music Festival just kicked off a few minutes ago. The weekend-long event boasts some of the big names of country music, and some fans, well, they're not going anywhere. They're there for the duration, camping right at the venue. KBOI 2's Morgan Wagner takes a look at some of the changes that the fans will be seeing this year. Some of those who came out to the first Mountain Home Country Music Festival will tell you it was a dusty mess out here, but concert managers say they've got a lot of new changes coming to this year's event, which includes adding more vegetation and some chemicals to the land. Dancing the night away to Blake Shelton last year left festival goers dusty, but those managing the event say they've laid down every possibility they could think of to keep the dirt from rising. Uh, we brought in 643 truckloads of decompressed granite and spread that out all over the venue. And then we had a chemical that we laid on top of here just a couple days ago, and it's a binding chemical. It's found in the Great Salt Lakes, and that has made a tremendous amount of difference for us. Another big issue with last year's event, dealing with the extreme summer heat. This year, five misting tents have been set up around the venue, along with a medical tent near the main stage. We have a big tent for everybody to come into and get some Gatorade for free. Um, and we have a medical tent behind that for people who actually need IV fluids. So if you're really bad off, we're going to stick one in you. How did we have that last year? We had about 55 people get IVs last year. Oh, wow. And five people get flown out by helicopter. And we don't want any this year at all. For every bottle of beer you have, doctors also suggest having a bottle of water, especially in this heat. Now, vendors will be selling water for $2 a bottle, $2 that will later be donated to our local schools. Reporting from the Mountain Home Music Festival, Morgan Wagner, KBOI 2 News.